Hey what's going on guys, Finn Dominator here back with another vlog video, so today we're going to be talking about why Sonic the Hedgehog, yep, this guy, is making a comeback. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. So guys, if you don't know, Sonic the Hedgehog has been around for a long, long time. He came out back in 1991, which seems so far away now, and his game took the market by storm when it came out, of course. But over the years, his games have been received like a lot less by critics. Like here, he started to rise with Sonic Generations and things like that. But he's like latest game, Sonic Forces, didn't get really mixed for reviews as well. So yeah, that's that's why Sonic the Hedgehog has been getting less popular over the years. But what I'm what do I mean by comeback? Well, I mean He's going to come back in and strike hard with some really, really good games, I think. Because, of course, we've got the new Sonic Racing game coming out this year and all that. So, you guys, the first reason he's making a comeback is the fact that Sonic Mania is the highest rated Sonic game in the last 15 years. Of course, guys, Sonic Mania's been out for a while now. Like I said, it is really, really high rated by the critics. And if you look in the Sonic Mania Plus trailer, you will see that it has been dubbed best Sonic game ever. Which I think is absolutely amazing. I can see where they're coming from. It's my second favourite game. The first one being Sonic Unleashed. That game is amazing. The boost mechanics in that game was perfect for me. Second reason is the Sonic the Hedgehog movie. If you don't know, a Sonic the Hedgehog movie has been slated to come out in 2019. This will help the revival of Sonic's career in the Gaming Institute. I believe if they do it right, and get out on the deadlines of November, December 2019, they will have a good movie, to, and perhaps some good games to go with it. Hopefully, they don't mess it up. Another thing we've got is that the Sonic the Hedgehog Twitter, YouTube, and Facebook pages all like interacting, and they like listening to the fan base. They, they, they released a poll recently about what, they, what we love to see. There was Chow Garden, uh, custom character, and then two other things, I don't remember what the other two were, but many people voted Chow Garden. Now, I don't know, but there's a slight chance because of this that a Chow Garden might be coming in the next game, and everyone loves the Chow Gardens, so that's going to be awesome. So yeah, that, that's going to be really cool. Another reason is, is that they're porting the Sonic Adventure and Sonic Adventure 2 onto the Nintendo Switch. They, Sega are you know, known for being lovers of the old style games, you know, like how they did, you know, Sonic Mania and Celebration of Classic Sonic to bring Classic Sonic back into the light, and how they used Sonic Generations and Sonic Forces to, to like, help advertise Classic Sonic, and then of course the TV, sorry, not the TV, the YouTube series, Sonic Mania Adventures, which currently has two episodes out at the time of this recording. So yeah, they really like Classic Sonic and Nostalgia. Which is why I think why they're adding the Dreamcast games in there. Of course, Sonic Adventure, Sonic Adventure 2, like I just said. Sonic Heroes has not been confirmed for that yet, though. I really hope it does, because Sonic Heroes is amazing. Not that I have a Switch myself, but I just think it would be cool if you got that game on the Switch. Like, who doesn't want to play Sonic Heroes, right? Another thing that's going to be bringing Sonic's comeback is that the people who work at Sega have announced that they're going to try bringing back you know, Sonic into the limelight, of course, with the movie. And as when the current like ruler for Sega or whatever, like I don't know, I wouldn't call it a ruler, but he said um he back in 2004 he said he wanted to you know revive Sonic like because of the less than well received game Sonic 06 came out. Uh, he didn't really like it too much. Like he didn't like the fact that it came out bad. So he wants to bring it back. I mean, he's taken a long time, but I think he will bring them back to greatness, back to good stuff, you know? Just how Sonic's supposed to be, up there competing with Mario and everything, like, giving him a run for his money, quite literally as well. So yeah, guys, that's what I think, that's what I think Sonic the Hedgehog is making a comeback. And it's taken a while, but, you know, he's gonna turn it around. So yeah guys, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe and hit the bell, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye.